Hey everybody, welcome back to the Big Fan Podcast. As always, I'm Chase. And I'm Andrew. And we're hitting you up with video. Yeah, first time video. First time video. We forgot my clips, so we're using these. So for sound quality, work with us. It won't be too bad because I got some tricks. I mean, there's always a way. Yeah. To... So how are you doing? I'm doing better. Monday. I'm, I'm excited. We've got this new camera here. Yeah, camera. Uh, it's a Canon T6i for you wondering. Um, for your tech nerds. It was, yeah. I mean, it was tough to p finally pick one yeah. because like this. We, we've been talking about video. Hundreds of options. Yeah. You know, so. GoPros and. Everything. The iPhone 6. Cell phones. iPhone 6 stuff. quality is ridiculous. It is. You know, so yeah, so we're now going video and it makes it, you know, we're excited because we'll be able to edit and we'll be able to uh, kind of try things out and everything. So plus our website, we have the ability to uh, Upload and everything, you know. We just edit this right here. Yeah, we do some cool fancy transitions. Transition. Yeah, see, so it's back now. So, Monday, start of the week. Does it feel like the start of the week to you? Uh, today, Are you one of those people who are like Mondays? Like, I don't no, know. I never really like that. For me, I'm like school, so it's like it's not like you know. It's just another day, right? Yeah, opinion. really. Yeah, since I don't have weekends or anything, it's just like Monday. You know? Yeah, I never had like the, oh, the freaking Monday. Can't. Someone got the case of the Mondays. Yeah. Uh, like, I really like being in the, like, the daily grind, I guess, of like retail. Hitting it and quit. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, you, like, you hear the same thing every week. Uh, it's, uh, oh, it's Monday. Oh, thank God it's Friday. Uh, like, every TGIF, it's Friday. So I, I can't stand, like, Those have you will, any of that stuff. So. Which is a good segue. I know to our list of things that make us mad. Yeah, we and like the, things. Yeah, we like things. I like, and lists. I like lists. People like lists. I hear another podcast, hearing some feedback. I mean, that's honestly how I picked this camera because of like, was lists. lists after lists. I'm yeah. like, this is number one, number two, number three. This is why, yeah, why, why. Exactly. So, uh, so I, was, I wasn't even like, I'll start it off with my number one here. It's not my number one, but it's my number one that I'm going to start off with. Um, it wasn't like I woke up like, fuck, it's going to be bad. Because I really don't have those type of days. Maybe sometimes, not really. But uh, I woke up, it was fine. But like, my thing is, when everything is going wrong. Right. I hate those. Because oh, it's yeah. just like, I don't wake up like, fuck, it, I feel bad. I feel sick. It's just, it was just cool. Have a cup of coffee, spill my coffee on my table. The like, whole thing? Fuck. Yeah, most of it. And it's just like, fuck. It's just, it starts with something small, you know? And that would be pretty big in my book. Like, cause... yeah. It's, I don't know, like, I mean, making coffee's a ritual, and then drinking it's kind of a ritual. Yeah, like, like especially, yeah, because I like coffee. And then, like, you get it on your paperwork, and, like, yeah, stains. Dude. And it's just like, <sighs> okay, let me clean that up. Let me clean that up. No problem. And then it's just like... Brush it off. You know, like, I, I want to say I dropped my phone, but just, like, I can't hold on to it, you know? <laughs> and then it's just like... I didn't drop it, but I couldn't hold on to it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, on my, on my car... Um, you know the little clip that holds the, the, the actual clicker from like fall all the way to the ground? I don't have that little device that on the seatbelt that stops oh, okay, okay. the thing. Sure. So my seatbelt clipper can just drop all the way to the ground. That and so sucks. it's sometimes it's not too bad, but like on the days where everything's going wrong, yeah. I'm sitting in the car like, motherfucker, motherfucker, you know, like Tony you Soprano. Where you just keep pulling. Yeah. And, and it's just stuff. like the car's moving. I'm trying to grab the fucking seat thing and just finally click it. I'm like, fuck. And then like, I drive down to the gate and everything, and right now with my brakes, my brakes aren't bad, my drum brakes, but they're just dirty, or so, there's like a film that's making noise, so they squeak like a motherfucker. And so there's time for help. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So when I hear it, I'm like, fuck you, bam! And I just slam on the brakes, so it's just like, I'm already just like, everything's not going well, you know? Some days that doesn't bother me, it's just, fuck, you know? So this one particular day where I broke everything going bad, so that's... Now I'm on the road. I'm like, okay, cool. Got my podcast going. I'm just, when I'm on the road, I'm pretty calm. You know, I'm not a road rager. So I start past, uh, I'm on this straightaway. And then as I'm going, there's two, I, I turn the curve, there's a straightaway. And I see two cars. Car B, the one in the back, is riding car to A's ass, right? And I'm still like semi-truck length behind both of them. So I start catching up. I'm not speeding. And as I get closer to him, I was like, oh, I'll just pass both of you, you know, blah, 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 because they wasn't, the car B was not passing still for some reason, so as I'm right fucking, like, I'm Maybe there, dude, I'm like, there, the fucking car B is like, vroom, 
Seriously? Right in front of me. And it's just like, I just let go of my gas. I'm just like, oh, fuck, are you fucking kidding me? Like, just like out of spite. I don't, I don't know why. It's just like, either like, no, you're not passing me. It's just like, I wasn't just like, I was just like, no, if you're not going to pass, I'm going to pass both of you. Right. And I mean, it was like, dude, if I was going three miles per hour faster, it would have clipped me. Cause she, really? she just went boom. You know what I mean? And I was like, holy shit, you know? So whatever. So pass and I pass and you know, she's going 95 down the road. I'm like, I just want to go 60, you know? Right, and right. You just want to go a decent speed. Like. Yeah, yeah. And I get to the gas station, right? And I hit my car, boom, boom, boom. And then I have the, you know, I'm waiting. I don't touch the buttons with my hands. I touch it with the nozzle, you know? Oh, right, right. And so I hit it. He's a clean freak. Oh, I, I just don't want to, like, touch things. He doesn't want AIDS. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he doesn't want AIDS. gas station AIDS. Don't want, you know, gas station nasty. I don't know what I was doing with Mike. But, um, so I hit the button. And it's just like, hit the button again. Hit the button again. I'm like, what the fuck, you know? And I start hitting buttons. It's just like 91. I get the expensive oh, gas. I'm like, I could have gone in. You went whack and roll on it. Yeah, I did. I did. Because I was just like, are you kidding me? And it wasn't like, you know, sometimes where it says car wash. I already, I already skipped you all that. Right. I was at the point where car wash is what you want. Mm -hmm. So I get the expensive gas. I could have gone inside, but I'm already like, fucking okay. okay. Who cares? I just want to go on the fucking road. Yeah. You know? And just... I don't know, you have days like that where it's just everything. It's just like the little things. It's like, been a while. Yeah, because fuck, dude, like, because like I don't really have like I don't uh, I don't really drink coffee that much in the mornings anymore. Yeah. So like I don't have to worry about that or just yeah. spilling it. Because coffee doesn't like, really like wake me up. It just me, like, my morning yeah. treat. It's my morning little. It treat. tastes good. Yeah, zero calories. Black. See, I can't do the black. I like I've black. tried. I haven't tried in a long time. I'll admit, but I'm willing to try it one more time. Big, black, Fan. strong. <laughs> but uh so like i've never it's been, uh, it's been a real i mean for me it's like a week long thing like uh, one thing a day or like maybe two things in one day and like uh, one thing on friday but like it really pisses me off you know uh, like, cause like, yeah. but like i hate those people like that will cut you off like that just for spite but not only is it just for spite but it's also really dangerous oh like, it's on my list <laughs> it's on my list you know yeah but um yeah, it, it's frustrating because it's just like I wasn't like being a dick to them. It was just like because, like I said, I was a good semi truck before I even got close to them, and we're still on the straightaway, straightaway where you had a she, good semi. she could have, yeah, I had a good semi yeah. where they could have passed, but for some reason they're just like she saw me passing, like oh, I can do it now. Like yeah, you could have done it before right. I even turned on the uh, on the turning point, and it was just like fuck, and it just. I don't know, just, you know, and then I get to school and it's hot and I'm just like, you know, I, I'm dropping like my keys or just, you know, just those little constant things. And I, I'm not the type of person where I take it home with me. I'm like, you know, I'm like, fucking back, you know, like we're better, you know, like you I'm never, yeah, I, I, oh. never, I don't, like once I'm home, I'm kind of like, fuck, all right, you know, have a, have a fucking like kettle one, a fucking glass of wine. Cause I'm just like, cool, I'm home now. Like I'm safe now, you know, like. But it's just like, I don't know, some of those days, like like I said, it was just last week I had a day like that. And it was just like, every little thing was just going wrong. And it was, it was just like, away at you. Oh, dude, it was just like, just bugging the shit out of me. It so you just... got super drunk. <laughs> that night? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that night I got poked. Well, might as well. Oh, yeah, dude. Like, but so, that was, that, so, like I said, those are the things that make us mad. That was my first one. It was just when everything is just going wrong. What'd you get? Uh, all right, so it's kind of weird. I have a tablet and a pad of paper in front of me. So, both, best of both worlds. People are like, why does he just not have his notes on that? Don't fucking worry about it. I had those reasons, <laughs> and I don't want to explain so You don't have to explain Yeah, it's fine. So, let's see. This is just like a bunch of little things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that I've noticed. Like, oh, yeah. Like, um, like luckily, I don't have what a... You got? I have a, like you have a Mac. Yeah, you got a Mac. I'm not bragging. Right I got now. a Mac. Like y'all, y'all PC is <laughs> like you can't afford it. Mac, but whatever. <laughs> they are expensive though. Yeah. yeah. But like when you go, because I, I use them, all, I use them all the time at work. Yeah. And you'll open up like program after program. You work at Mac now? No, I'm saying like Windows. Oh, I, I got you. Yeah, yeah. But I use Windows all the time, and every time you want to exit, yeah, it pops up. Are you sure? Like, why the fuck did I not? Like, it doesn't yeah. ask you if you want to open it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So why does it ask me if I want to leave it? Like, I, you know, like, <laughs> Do you want to open this? Like, I, think, like... I think it should be the case for, like, certain programs. Like, yeah. maybe, like, if you're doing document files. Save, program, yes. Like, yeah, do you want to save? Not like, yeah. do you want to exit? If I hit exit, I want to exit. I want to exit you. Yeah. So that <laughs> no. really, like, pisses me off. So. Yeah, because you think you're done walking away, but no, you got to go back to the computer. Yeah, like, I got to close that window. Like, yeah, exactly. No, like, man, cute. I mean, I don't know. I haven't really played with Windows for a long time. Is there a setting where you can change that? 
probably not. It's probably right. just it's like it's, baked in. It's right? baked in yeah. there where it's just like, you sure you want to quit? Like, yeah, I want to quit. That's a good point because it never it never questions you. Like, do you want to open this? Yeah. What if you didn't want to open it because like it can like slow the rest yeah. of your PC down or like your other yeah. programs down? Especially the ones where it's just like, ooh, we gotta be an administrator to open this. Like, motherfucker, this is my computer. Right. I am the administrator. Yeah. I am God. To you exactly. open up. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. you have my permission to open up. Like, is it seeing anything seem fishy? Yeah. No. Just no. open it up. I'm opening up fucking PowerPoint. Okay. Yeah. You got it. Yeah, if it was like a like a bank app or like whatever bank something, something like, like that. You sure you want to open this in, in public? Or like yeah. those programs that have like all your access codes in them, yeah. like in one spot. Something like that. You that know, makes something sense. like that, but uh, that's it's frustrating. So that, that was one of them. Another one is like, <laughs> I don't know, like it happens randomly, yeah. but like having someone like if you're texting or like writing something, someone's just hovering over your oh, shoulder. Yeah, dude. Like, See, if I catch myself from that, I'm like, oh, I walk away. Cause like, I'm not intentional, like what, what you got? Yeah. But if someone's like, in such in classroom situations. Get curious, whatever. Yeah, it's like in classroom situations, they're just like, <laughs> right. Yeah. you know, watching, like I'm gonna watch it. And then sometimes they like look back like, I'm just like, <laughs> disgusted. Like, like fuck, I'm not like creeping on you, but you have it up to, you know, you have it up to here. So I'm just like. like the same thing with chicks with low cut shirts. It's like, oh, are you looking at my chest? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. That's another one I hate. You were offering. <laughs> Tight pants. Cleavage and everything. Yeah. And like you get caught and they're like, oh, just like, what? Or the whole thing. Like I do it for my image. Like, yeah, 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 like, exactly. For my self-confidence. Like yeah. really like. And then like, because like, I got caught like a couple times because like we're dudes or whatever. They look back and just like. And? Look at me. Yeah. Like, whatever. Guys. <laughs> yeah. I gotcha. I gotcha. That's so another one of yours. All right. So one of mine right here. Um, kind of still go to the car. I think this is the big, I think everyone agrees on this, is blinkers. Like, like people not using them? Just not, they're just dead. I'm a firm believer in blinkers. Yeah, me too. Because you know what, if you hit me, I'm using my blinker, and you weren't, you weren't using a blinker. Yeah. You owe me. I mean, they, they can just lie about it, but. Oh, yeah, but I'm going to tell the truth. Right. And I'm going to tell, like, I'm telling the truth. The truth I'm, is I'm, I'm, telling the, I'm telling the truth cop. Yeah. He uses blinker. But it's just. Don't look at my beard. And yeah. <laughs> what I'm wearing today. Just Don't judge me, me right yeah. now. But no, it's just, it's insane where they, we, the majority, because I drive about 100 miles a day commuting to school, right? So I'm on the road. I see a lot of shit. Yeah. And the fact that blinkers are just not used anymore is just, it's just astounding because, because there's, like, I was trying to, like, make a list, <laughs> a list of type of drivers, you know? And, like, the people that cut you off, there's a few of them. There's the creepers who just, like, yeah, I'm coming over, you know? And there's the fucking, boop, Houdinis like, who last just second fucking guys. just pop over. Yeah. And none of them using blinkers. No. Or you have the people coming from lane one to lane five all the way over, which is super dangerous. That's really scary. Cause... And it's just, like... You know, I, I, I was, I was, I learned how to drive where you leave like about two car lengths in front of you because if, if, if that person breaks, it gives you time to break. And if you were even closer, you're, it's going to be one of those, uh, accordion effects, right. you know? So I always try to, you you're know. You're talking about like right before you, you hit your blinkers to go? Yeah. Like, you like, know what I mean? Like you're, so you're driving down the freeway, like, it's yeah. fun for everyone at home. Yeah. Um, you're driving down the road, you hit your blinker. But you still leave that gap in front of you because you're looking over your shoulder. Yeah, yeah. And you don't know if the park car that person's gonna break. stop, yeah. whatever. So you and give that, us that buffer zone. Yeah, yeah. dude. And people like, don't do that. People don't. It's just, it's just like, it's just crazy how many people just don't. And especially like, um, even turning or like just lane changing or just anything. Just people like, like there's a four way stop and it's just like it seems like it's Russian roulette. Like right. who's turning? Yeah. You know, like oh, I am. You know, and they just like turn into you. And it's just like, I don't know, like. And it just seems like it's not like really a big deal, you know. Like people are just like it is what it is, but it's just like I think we're doing good work here. I think we're teaching people how to drive right. Yeah, now. because like we, I think we tend to forget that we are driving in a big metal structure. Thank you. Yeah. That is will easily kill you. The, I told we're not in some like bubble thing. It's just right. like oh, belts off. Force yeah. field. Yeah, we're yeah. in a fucking car that's metal and glass. You know what I mean? Because I always fear like some pole is going to go through me. You know what I mean? That's <laughs> like my fear. Destination yeah, that's action. my fear is that some sort of pole yeah. is going through that's me. possible. And I it's mean, just like, use your blinkers. Just use your blinkers. You know what I mean? I mean, I told, I told my girl this a few times. Like, use your after, blinkers? <laughs> no, well, no. She's actually pretty good at it. Right? Uh, um, but like, it's crazy that like, there's a lot of accidents. Don't get me wrong. But it's crazy that uh, there's not a hundred more than yeah. there are already. Oh, yeah. Because like, so some roads like, like Highway 18 we have here. Yeah. Just two lanes, and yeah. you're going like 70 plus sometimes. Yeah, which speed limit is 55, with like 60. A few feet between you and another box of speeders. Yeah, like, 
Dude, it's insane. Like, it's especially it's like a lot, there's a lot of older cars still on the road, so those yeah. things are pure older metal. People, yeah, older people. Oh, dude, like I'm gonna start it. Like, it's just especially mergers, and it's just it's fucking crazy. Like, and then like like I said, I drive a lot. I've always drove a lot. It's my old job. So like statistically, I should fucking have gotten a wreck already. Right. And since so so you have it, I haven't. I've only been in one, which was like five years ago, which is not my fault. Like some guy was trying to make a yellow t left uh -huh. and he just boom, plowed into me when I was going like 20 miles you know uh -huh. my shit just turned green sure. but I have not gotten a wreck on the freeway like fucking you know knock on wood or whatever yeah. and I really you know, I don't believe in that shit but that's another just, thing I hate people are like but don't jinx it like, like you're gonna I'll double fucking jinx it you're gonna die now <laughs> yeah, that's it exactly so just like statistically so. I probably should have been in wrecks but it's just cause there's the amount of people cut me off for people who just like like today a good example was going down the freeway to school all of a sudden, fucking brakes. And I'm like, what the fuck? And I hit my brakes. Then, like, you know, burn rubber and thing. But what people are braking for, and I understand baby people are like, oh, God. But it's just like, they're not paying attention, probably. Yeah. Texting, whatever. Well, they just see the red lights in the distance. Exactly. What they're braking was uh, two people on each side of the freeway running down because, like, I guess some boxes fell off and, like, their clothes were on the side of the road, not in the middle of the road, anything. No. So they were just like, they're people. Just, they're just looking, like, oh. Yeah. And it was just like, oh, God. And it was just like, yeah. dumbass. Right. There's fucking people behind you going 80 miles per hour right now on yeah. the freeway. And it was just like, oh, and it's just. Well, I mean, they have that thing in, in Asia, right, where if there's a wreck, they literally put up a wall, like a like a tent, a sheet. So people don't fucking so people, looky lose. Yeah, so I didn't put that. looky lose because I was like, I don't want to do nothing about freeway shit. But right. like looky lose are the worst because there's times where you drive by and it's just like it's on the other side of the fucking freeway. I mean, you put flashy lights over there. I'm gonna look at flashy lights. Exactly. Like, What's that? We're all little kids inside. Like, there was know. one accident that I yeah. slowed down because, like, yo, people died. Like, right. just real people died yeah. on that and one. You see, like, the half of a car just yeah. gone. And then it's just like, yeah, like that. So, but I didn't want to put looky lose, but I think everyone hates looky lose. If you didn't know everybody, we're talking about stuff we don't like today. Yeah. Uh, so, okay. we're gonna be complaining a lot. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> if, you, if you don't know me as a person, <laughs> like, complain. You're like, complain a lot. So. <laughs> Dude. What would you get? What would you get? Uh, another, one? another Juan I have. Juan you got? Um, oh, this happens sometimes on the weekends. Like, yeah. I don't really make breakfast during the week because yeah. I don't get up early enough. Yeah, yeah. Plus, I can't eat early. Like, I can't eat at 6 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. So, yeah. we we'll make breakfast on the weekends. Yeah. And sometimes I'll make over easy eggs, right? Okay. Okay. So, you're making them, you're making them. You know, everything's they going fine. Break. They're all going fine. Yeah. And there's like that last one or the one in the middle of yeah. like, it just breaks yeah. and just spoils the whole. I don't eat. Yeah, like, well, I don't eat. Just scrambled eggs now. Like, <laughs> screw this crap. Like, yeah. I hate, I, yeah. it really gets. You know, they don't serve uh, over easy at some places. Why? Because Can of like, eggs? no, no, uh, if, I mean, if, but they don't serve it because of, um, nah, it's not healthy, but um, it's not cooked all the way through. Mm. So some places won't, do that because they're just it's like uh, if you're having uncooked chicken like you know, there's, that's night and day almost because uncooked chicken actually like yeah, kill, kill you kill. but um, like uh, over easy eggs they won't cook them because it's just like not sanitary or some shit whatever but weird right like that's fucking kind of don't break the yolk yeah. don't fucking make me over easy you know do what I mean do what I ask yeah don't worry, I ask. I'm putting it in my body yeah, do you want a tip <laughs> This is my body and my rice. Yeah, exactly. So, no, no. no. <laughs> I think that in general with food, you know, like yeah, um, like people like a lot of places won't serve uh, undercooked like raw meat. Like, well, not not chicken. I'm saying, I'm saying like, yeah, steak. raw meat. Like, yeah. cook it raw. Yeah. And the thing is uh, about food is when they don't bring it back raw. Yeah. Like I am not a dick when it comes to restaurants. Yeah, you know? I won't be like, look at this. This is the problem. Yeah, you know, I won't. I will never do that. But it's, than that. Exactly. But it's just times where I'm like. Like this isn't like this is this is well done. Right. Like this, this is the opposite. Is yeah, this is burnt and it's just like yeah. fucking like I'm a big like pink. Okay, I want a bloody inside. I you love know, it. I'm fine with any way it's cooked. I can yeah. it can be bloody, it could be super charred, like, yeah, I will eat it. I'll eat it. I will eat it. I'm gonna eat that meat. But yeah, but when it's fucking that meat's pink though and bloody it's, so. I want meat in my mouth. But when it's fucking pink and bloody, it's so good. Yeah. So good. So good. Something primal about it. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's just well the flavor too. There's more flavor into it. It's pretty you know juicy. Pretty juicy. Uh, one you more. Got? Let me see. Um, so I got a few. <laughs> it's all about me right now. <laughs> no, uh, the self checkout. Like, oh god, those uh, don't work. Those well, don't work. Yeah, I mean, well, sometimes stop doing do. those. Sometimes give me a human. Yeah, and fucking do your job. Exactly. You know what I mean? mean? You pretty much got on the point. Like, we hired cashiers. Yeah. But we'd rather you not use them. 
Yeah, you know, right. you have 10 or 12, sometimes 14 Which are lanes. never being used. Have never. you ever been to anything, like, even like a Black Friday where they're all being used? Like Once. Like one time? It was because of Black Friday. Black Friday. But like normal days where it's like busier than hell. I'm like, <sighs> you know who's actually pretty decent, I'll oh. give a nod to, is Costco. They're, they're pretty, pretty good. Pretty decent. Uh, yeah, they're pretty. They have a good amount. They There's like, never like two. Right, no. Like, that would be ridiculous. There'd be like a line. I'll leave my cart. Yeah. yeah. But people would, though. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Costco's the best yeah. for liquor. And snacks. something else, right? Like snacks. pizza or some shit or snacks. Oh, right? and you you snack while you shop. Oh, that's true. Yeah, they got me there. So. Uh, yeah, you got me sausages. <laughs> got me. Yeah, you got me. You salt. got me. But yeah, the liquor is the best. No, okay. So back to stuff. Oh, so, yeah. So like, I don't. I mean, I get why they have certain yeah. things. So, like the where you buy it, you buy something and then. It says, please place it in the in the bag. Right? Oh, God, yeah. Like, it's like a piece of gum. Why, I'm going to keep this in my hand, okay? Yeah. The machine. Like, it, it won't even read the weight. It's just like... Yeah, it's for the weight. That's the only reason. Oh. But like, and it says, okay, you can now like lift it up now. Like, I'm taking orders from the freaking robot. Yeah, no, it doesn't even work right. <laughs> Let's see, I get mad because I've used it where it won't read it. It's like, right, just put it yeah. in the bag and just like... You're like, please put it in the bag. And it's just like, motherfucker, do you read it? Because I get fucking Tony Soprano sometimes, like, when I do explode. I get fucking mad, but, like, I get mad inside. Like, I don't ever, like, just explode. Yeah, I just, like, start shaking and sweating. It's, those those, those just don't work. Self-service things that just don't work. Big percentage of the time. I get it, I guess, in theory, but, I mean. Give me a human. I mean, if they, if you have them there on shift, like. Because like, half of me is like, cool, I don't have to talk to someone. Right. Because that's right. awesome. I don't want to talk. I don't want them weird questions. Like, oh, you're buying a drill? Don't talk to me, please. You know? And, you. but B, it's just like, fix this right. so I don't have to talk to someone, but this shit works. Like, well, I mean, they have that one person who's designated to overlook the whole area anyway. Yeah. And those people are so rude. Yeah, well, Ma'am, you're doing it wrong. Right. Like, fuck you. Fuck yeah. you. Well, why don't you just do it for yeah, me? Yeah, do it for me. <laughs> and and sometimes they will it. do it too. It's yeah. just like, with that heart? Yeah. You're getting paid by an hour, right? So I'm going to look for you next time. You just keep doing yeah, this, okay? Keep doing just this. Keep doing what now you I'm just a cashier. Oh. Congratulations. You've been upgraded. <laughs> yeah, you're, now you're now bumped up from supervisor computers yeah. to a fucking cashier. Jeez. <laughs> That's good. What's up? What's up? All right, right here. People know me. I mean, I, People do, know do, me. Do you know what a jibber-jabber is? What do you think a jibber-jabber is? When I think jibber-jabber, I think of someone who just doesn't know how to shut up. Okay. I turn a jibber-jabber to that. To a jibber jabber is someone who doesn't know how to stop talking, mm. who is also talking to me. Oh, oh, he's, okay. I see what you're saying. Like, because if I'm in the hallway, yeah. I'm just standing there, maybe on my phone. Yeah. And like, maybe we had a class together or something like that, right? Yeah, some, you're like, some kind of connection. Hey, Chase. I'm like, fuck. <laughs> you're like, here it goes. Here we go. Yeah. You know? And it's just like, so class, right? Yeah, you yeah. know. Sure. That Do the cool. homework. Yeah. But with the midterm there, right? Just like, oh, we stop, stop it. Just, and just not besides that, but just anytime we're in public, if I don't know you, know you, don't talk to me. Don't right. jibber jabber me. Because it's just, like, I don't want to do it. Like just talking for the sake yeah. of talking. Because like, like, uh, people don't like, they don't like the awkward silence. I just don't like, I, I do. <laughs> I will. No, that's what I'm yeah, saying. People, people don't like don't it. Don't like it. I will be, me and another person in the room, yeah. the happiest person if we don't yeah. talk. Perfect. But like there's times where there's a, there's a couple people that come to mind. I won't drop names, but like, Tell me I'll, names. I'll be sitting on What's like, your Twitter? I don't, I don't think one of them is <laughs> even on a Twitter game. But this one person will be in a class and he'll be just like, So, Big Bear, huh? I'm like, yeah. Oh, because of the fire. It's sh- random shit. Just random shit about Big Bear because I'll get close to it, you know? Sure. And they're like, you, you know the one parks? I guess we have a, there's a couple, you know? Yeah. The Snow Summit, right? I've been to a park once. <sighs> It's just like, fuck. You know, and just like, and then I, I catch my t- myself that time, like, now I'm going to turn my dick switch off. You, you got, got to, a dick switch. I got a dick switch, yeah, which yeah, I, yeah. I can't turn on. Where do you keep it? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like just, having two dicks. Yeah, I just fucking just switch it back on. Nice. And it's just, I'll turn it on quickly, and it'll just, I'll, you'll regret talking to me. You and go, if you I go have, from zero to zick, dick zip. Yeah, I, I go from zero right. to dick. Right, okay. In, in a dick second, you know? Okay. And I've t- done this to people, and then after that, we never talk again. And I'm just like, hey. Mission accomplished. Sometimes a nod, and I'm like, hey, you learned your lesson, didn't you? Don't talk to me. Well, <laughs> but, next time you pass them up, like, 
remember what happened. <laughs> you, you, got remember what happened. Everyone, you remember what <laughs> you happened. You got the dick, didn't you? Yeah. But I just, Jimmy Gabbers. I don't like people, even like random strangers. If like, like one time uh, me and the lady were at uh, like OGs, right? And we're watching the basketball game. And I'm wearing a hat, you know, supporting the team. And, and then some guy was just like, you guys are looking good. Like, Don't talk to me, dude. Like, yeah. and well, just, I mean, sports is like the biggest, like, portal oh, it is. It to is. any guy. So, and like, I hate it. Yeah. When I don't do, I don't do the people. I'm like, <laughs> nice hat, right? <laughs> Fucking 49. Like, I don't want to do that to you. Right. I don't do that. Because obviously, obviously, you like it. I like it. That's it. But I don't like it when people are like, dude, <laughs> what about that trade? What about it? I'm not going to stand here and have a 10 minute yeah, conversation. About, and then and most of the time, it's just dumb being a dick to me. You know? You know? I think. I don't, be, I don't want no dicks. I guarantee you that there's people, though, that'll no. wear a hat. Or a piece of clothing with sports yeah. for the sole purpose of hoping they get in a conversation. Oh, yeah, totally. Totally. Because there's like lonely people out there. It's very lonely so, people. So, I mean, especially lonely sports people, like they know all your stats for this, this, yeah. and this, bro. Matt. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. But, um, so, yeah, I mean, I'm sure that's a thing. All right, but it's just, I don't know, just don't talk to me. If I don't talk to you, this is my rule. If I don't talk to you, just don't talk to me. <laughs> on, their, on, their, on their side, how are they supposed to know that? Just, just, just because those jibber jabbers assume that everyone obviously is a jibber jabber. Also, yeah. but, well, here's a good way. Here's a good way. I'm gonna be like this. Not every time on my phone. But I'm gonna be like this, and they'll be like, "So Chase, I'm just like, yeah." And just it's it's, it's that's actually one of my topics. <laughs> rude people. <laughs> but yeah, just like that is a role. If you ever see me, maybe give me one of these, and I might do it back to you. But <laughs> one of these, one of those. <laughs> just don't come in my bubble. People in my bubble, I hate. But anyways, just close, close talking. <laughs> just that, close, close shit, talking. that shit right there. When someone, feel it especially right. if they're like not in, like they're just like, what, what is that? And just yeah. like, do you not see where you're at right now? Like yeah. back up, you know. But it can get dangerous quick because people is on my. Number <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know one thing I hate. People, uh, people turns out. So subscribe, everyone, uh, and follow. Us. That's why I like audio podcasts. <laughs> I'm here. You're wherever you are. We're still getting what we want. Enjoy exactly. It. Yeah, everyone wins. Win yeah, exactly. Yeah. This medium is good. People. People. They suck. <laughs> so the next thing I was going to say was, um, you kind of brought it up for yeah. me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, talking on the phone and you're obviously busy. Even yeah. if you're not talking on the phone, even if you're texting yeah. or you have earbuds in yeah. and someone insists on coming up to you and just starts talking. They don't even like... They don't even yeah. like. They don't even like stand around do the hover yeah. so you can like catch a drift. Like, oh, maybe you didn't want to talk to me. Yeah. They're just like, so how was your day? Like, blah blah blah. blah. Traffic, right? Like, <laughs> sky is blue. Sure. <laughs> just no. It's etiquette, dude. Like, I think this oh, TV, huh? Loss of etiquette. I swear, because it's annoying. Yeah, I'm telling you, people are the worst. <laughs> I mean, just act right. Just that. Just don't. Just don't trip. Just act right. Okay, just, get... just act right, and it's frustrating. It's just like. I don't know. Like, I'm not a phone person either. <laughs> you mean like talking on the phone? Yeah, oh, if you call me on the yeah, phone, I'll, I'll be like, you I don't think text I, me. I don't think that many people are. No, but... I think it, those same jibber-jabbers are the only ones who are. Like, <laughs> there's a, like, a certain type. The jibber-jabbers are the phone truckers. people. Oh, yeah. Truckers, yeah, truckers, truckers are a whole different breed. Yeah, they are. They're, they're different. Animal, so. They're really weird. You know what I mean? Like, uh, to speak of truckers, like one time, uh, the last season for football, before the actual real season started... Um, for preseason, the Niners and the Broncos were going to play. And so uh, me and Chris, uh, Chris Hurt, which hopefully we get on the podcast soon because awesome guy. But I was wearing my jersey, he's wearing his jersey. And I, I bought his baby girl a jersey for the Broncos, you know, as a gift. And I was like, hey, we got to get a picture because she was finally old enough, like big enough to wear her little oh, jersey and everything. I was like, oh, we got to get a picture, blah, blah, blah. And he's like, oh, how are we going to do it? I was like, oh, fuck. I was like, well, there's a driver here, you know, because where we work, there's truckers. And he was like, all right. And I was like, uh, so I walked to the driver. This guy's fucking a googly eye, goofy, goober, dork. Just the worst. Anyway, so I'm he's like, a yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I'm like, hey, you mind taking a picture, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And he's like, oh, yeah, that's no problem. And I was like, oh, yeah, you know, here, just hit the button. And you know, like, if I'm he was just like, how do I do it? Oh, my God. And I'm just like, oh, just. Take, just like, well, and then he was just like, well, I don't know how close you guys want it. I was like, well, don't stand right behind us. Just take a picture so you can see our names on the back, right. kind of thing, you know, or oh, yeah, right, just yeah. that. And he was just like, huh? like just <laughs> super googly, dude. And it was just like, I remember after he, I was like, well, just take a few, just hit the blah blah. blah. And I remember some of them were just like, 
let's say if he's facing here, he was just doing, like, he was just randomly decking the, it was just like, like oh, look at that bird over there. And it was just like, he was like, no emotion, he's like, yeah, they were good, it was just like, alright, weirdo, like, fuck, this is googly, dude. Like, well, I, I honestly thought you were going to go the opposite, where he's just like, oh, like, that team is cool, like, just starts talking no, no, about no, no, anything. He, he was actually a good person for that Jibber jabbery. So it was a win lose. It was a win lose because he was just straight like weirdo. Weirdo. It was just like you can't win win. You can't win win these days. <laughs> you know what I mean? You either get one or the other, or you get a mixture of both. Um, <laughs> let me see. What else did I have? Did you have any more topics or any more things you hated? In oh life? yeah. Okay. Let's go and get one more of yours. One more. All right. One more. All right. So this is the biggie. I'm, I'm gonna combine two because this is a biggie of mine. Like I get like. People who sigh in public when they're wanting attention. Uh, Shit like that. And I'm also doing a slash vague posters. Thank you. Like on Facebook, right? So, Bad day. How was your day, Jimmy? Yeah. Oh, thanks for asking. Yeah. So I'm going to start with the attention grabbers of Cyrus. I'm in the class, right? I actually had that one down also. You got that too? Yeah. Oh, high five, right? Because So we're sitting in class. See, I, see five, I didn't touch my five. nose and do it. I was like, oh, let's switch Anyways, so we're in class, and there's about, you know, eight of us. We're working on our projects, right? And so I'm just doing my thing, blah, 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 and I, I keep hearing this one guy go, It's <sighs> <sighs> having the roughest day. <sighs> what? <sighs> and the teacher's not there. I think he's there. No, the teacher wasn't there at the moment. And so you know he's just wanting, hey, what's going on? Yeah. And I won't, I won't bite. I'm not those people. I hate biting. Not gonna bite. It. I'll do. I'll not bite. Even if I, I really, like genuinely interested. I'll bite. Like, look over. you and be like, say something yeah. if you want to say yeah. something. I'm but not he gonna just, ask he you. He kept going and it's like, <sighs> <sighs> and finally the teacher walked in. He was like, hey, what's going on there, Demetrio? Or some, you know, something stupid. And he's like, well, I can't get this to Baba. And it was just like, ask. Yeah, ask them. You're in a classroom full. Of ask, people. dude. And it just like it just bugs me when people are just yeah. like, because I don't mind the sigh like, fuck, what's going on? But it's just the constant sigh, sure. and it's just like, just fucking ask. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. And yeah. like, I, 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 this is one guy in particular that fucking does. I've had him a couple times. Yeah. Was a fucking sports coat in the summer. The dude, fuck off. He's got style. Huh? No, he's a fucking <laughs> dickhead, dude. He's a dickhead for wearing a sports coat in hundred degree weather. He's like know? a Don Draper. No, he's no, he's not a Dom Draper. No, <laughs> he's exactly. Dom no. Draper. It was not. It was just, it's just so frustrating. He's just like sign, sign, and just like, like you get it, you have issues. Yeah, dude, and it's so just so do I. So, but yeah, so yeah, same thing on Facebook. You mentioned like, um, feeling exhausted. Uh, another. It's worse when they don't even post it. It's worse when they do the. The Facebook, like, what are you watching? What are you uh, feeling? Yeah. It's worse when they just do, what are you feeling? And it's just like... Aggravated. Aggravated. And it just says, John Smith is aggravated. And it's uh, just like, well, what's wrong? What's wrong? Uh, it's just like, your fucking life is wrong. You know what it is? It's like the leftover beginnings of the beginning of social media, media where like people would just post like, I'm eating a sandwich now. Pooping. Yeah, pooping. <laughs> and then like they would do the same thing, like, bad day. Uh, a rough morning. Yeah. And just, just for the reason that people are like, oh, are you okay? You know what you do? Text your best friend. Yeah. Like, yo, this hey sucks, dude. And Facebook has messaging, direct yeah. messaging. I can do that. Yeah. Like, if I'm having a fucking day, I'll text a, a, a good friend of mine, like, fuck, dude, fucking today, blah, blah, blah. I will not be the type of person to be just like, feeling depressed. Yeah. Fucking kill yourself. Or at the very least, like, just. Fucking end it right now. At the very least, describe what you're, what you're upset about in the post. Yeah. Just so people know what the hell to ask you about. Just don't, don't right. attention grab me, cause I won't bite. Talking to you. <laughs> and you know who you are. Yeah. I don't think anyone who listens to, hopefully, if you're one of those people. I mean, I will not unfriend you. Oh, one, one more, please, one more. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. please. Yeah. Um, are the people that, that like do? You guys are complaining. <laughs> <laughs> I got a whole heap. Um, I, no, like I think one that bugs me almost more than those, yeah. almost, is very, very close, close for last, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Is the people who post, if you love Jesus, please share in the next three seconds. Because Jesus is really tripping about likes and shares and yeah. comments, you know what I, I mean? I almost want to put the whole thing like, if you like air, <laughs> share, like have the guts to share. <laughs> yeah, the, have the guts one yeah. is the best. This is like, if you, you have the guts you're to gonna share suffocate. this one, but Jesus? Yeah. Woo. Like, you ballsy. <laughs> you ballsy if you love Jesus. Like, I don't like who are those people? Like, like, they're, if, they're, you're, if you're posting it ironically, fine. Yeah. 
But most of the time, they're not. No. It's, it's the people who are super religious, which is fine. I don't care. But they're so super religious that they're like, you know, Facebook is just not a connection to God. No. It's actually probably the opposite. It's usually a trend <laughs> yeah. on the people who post. Exactly. You know, probably some 13-year-old 13 13 year kid who made this fucking meme picture thing, you know? Yeah, just to be funny. And then people don't want it. Yeah, those, those are pretty bad. It's just like... You know, if this girl doesn't get 500 guts. likes, and she's going to die of cancer. Like, yeah, just like... She's going to die. Good. She's dying. <laughs> she's dying. She's dead. <laughs> likes aren't going to save her. So if we can stop that and just... Just deal with shit. Be like me. <laughs> I, I kind of... I, I haven't had the balls to do it yet. We just say... Each one of those comments that yeah. I possibly can see, just hit stop. Just write stop. Just stop. Yeah. Just stop. See what I do. So if you guys can do that for us, just, <laughs> yeah, just start something. See what I. Because what I do is um, on Facebook. I mostly use Facebook for news, maybe like sports too. stuff. That's what I say. I do really. for like tech news and crap. stuff like that. And um, one one of the, I don't know, groups or pages I like is um, Big Bear stuff for sale, stuff like that. You know, ninety nine percent of the time, no one's selling shit. They're just like complaining. Right. And so, so for instance, like most of the time people are like doing garage sales or, Hey, I'm selling this, I'm selling this, or I'm searching for this, blah, blah, blah. But most of the time it's like people are like, a couple of kids were walking down the street and fucking, this one down, and there'd be like 40 comments. And then here I come in like, what, what are you selling? <laughs> and then I'll get like 10 people like, I'm not selling anything. I'm uh, just trying to blah, blah, blah. I'm like, awesome. hey, I'm gone. Yeah, I thought this was a selling thing. <laughs> I'm gone. Yeah. So I've done that quite a few times. I'm like, oh, what are you selling? And then I, I'll get like three or four, like, what she's selling is this and that, you know, just like information. People, that, people are so quick to defend each other yeah. who don't even know each other. It's just right. like, hey. just just to be the white knight. Not only did I just come in like troll, now I'm out. And you back out. I get, and what I do is you have to undo yourself. I would that link. What I do is no notifications. Right. right yeah. <laughs> so yeah. now, you know, you now they're flooding. I'm just like, yeah. oh, I'm gone. You ever check back? Uh, sometimes, like, uh, but not mostly. I'm over it now. Like, I just, actually, I think I actually unfollowed it because they were not even selling. No one's selling anything. And I try to sell shit, and they're just like, people, the moment you say, people are driving fast, you're, you get 50 fucking comments in a thing like that. But when we try to sell something, they're just like, huh? You know what I mean? Like, I understand I don't want to buy everything, but it's just like, I mean, oh. There's a whole other, like, fan page for that it's called the muse of big bear or something I'm yeah sure yeah i'm sure like, there is or your fucking news feed i'm guessing you follow that too yeah, yeah. <laughs> do your own fucking news feed for that yeah. kind of shit you know so um, you know what just let's just take these lessons and don't do these things yeah please all right so what you got wanted to switch it up yeah uh we like video games yeah um, love them i played a lot of games where i'll be Oh, yeah, you're fine. Yeah, um, play a lot of games where you like fall in love with not only the characters, yeah. but it's got a great story. Yeah. It's it's got decent graphics, if not gorgeous graphics. Yeah. And you sink a lot of time in these games. Yeah. So hours. Oh uh, yeah, a lot of hours. Multiple hours. Sometimes yeah. hundreds of hours. Yeah, yeah. You know, depending on the game. Um, I wanted to ask you, like, yeah. do you ever get that feeling of when you play these games, you know, you love? Yeah. Of uh, both knowing that it's going to end. Yeah. Like you're going to beat like it. You know, like when that last part, that third part yeah. of the game's coming up, you're like, oh. Like you want to finish because it's got a great story. Yeah. But you but also you know because you've been there before that once you finish it, you're going to feel this empty pit of like, what now? Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. I no, I I wrote three just because these three impacted me the most. Now, after I ended, I was just like, what do I do now? What yeah. do I play? I'm sure they're probably similar to mine. Yeah, yeah. So uh, I'll start. My, my first one is one of my, I think we talked about it before in our uh, video game podcast with Taylor, um, is Knights of the Old Republic. Oh, really? Like, hands down, it's my favorite game. It was very fun. To this day, I, I actually just bought it off like the App Store. It's on the App Store for Max for like nine bucks. What now, console did it come out on? 64? Oh, no. No? Uh, it was just computer. No, it was like originally it was yeah. PC and Xbox. Original. Xbox Goliath. That's okay. The original. I don't, I don't think I... it was PlayStation. I think no, it originally was know. Xbox. Yeah. And yeah. it was PC and Xbox, the original Xbox. And like it was I think it was like I said, I think I said like you can go back to our video game podcast, which is a really good one. Um, but uh it's one of the best RPGs, which stands for a role playing game, and it's 
Bioware, who does these Star Wars games, they do some of the best RPG storytelling. And yeah, really good. I fell in love with it. To this day, I fucking, I, like, I'm playing it, like, you know, 30 minutes here and there on my computer. I'm like, oh, fuck yeah. You know, I, it's, like, not even the best graphics. This is the old no, game. It's, no, like, 2005 yeah. or some shit. So even though back then to us, they were the best. Yeah, exactly. And it's just, right when you get it done, I'm just like, fuck. Like, fuck, you know? Like, yeah. fuck. But then th that game also has, like, I'm going to do it again. Because you fucked up on a couple things, or right. you you didn't save this, and but just that game had the biggest impact of like, what now? Sure. Like, what do I do? Like, you know what I mean? It's just like, I didn't dive right back into replay, but that game has one of the best. Feelings. So do you, do you get that feeling though, like, of like, um, I don't know if you've ever felt this with a movie. Yeah. But like, say you're watching a movie, and the, the credits roll, and like sometimes the music just gets it where like. I, what am I gonna do, do with my life now? Oh. Like, like there's still the <laughs> Jesus <laughs> fucking. This <laughs> movie's dead. To me now. No, but you know what I mean. But like, no, that's yeah, same yeah. Thing. Like, you just kind of feel like, um, not lost, but kind of like, what do I do now? I think like, those big impactful movies that are not preachy, but like, are somewhat trying to preach to you about something. You're just like, yeah, that's true. You know, like, I'm just coming, like, I always said before, I'm the worst at top of my head thinking, but, no, yeah, like, I've had that before where it's just like, shit. So you think it's kind of similar for the game, like, or is it something different? I think it's a little more in-depth of the game, because especially, like, RPGs where you're that person. You're building that character. You're building that character, and you're just, you're playing about this whole, especially these days with games, but, like, you have these, they're, like, award-winning writers, you know what I mean? Yeah. And it's just, like, playing a voyage, and at the very end, you're just like, you know, like, you're just like, shit, you know, like, fucking, so yeah. my first one was Knights of the Republic, that just had, like, the biggest, like, once it ended, it was just like, because that game, you can spend hours, it was just, sure. you spend so much time, because you also play games of, uh, mini games inside of it called Bazak, mm -hmm. which is basically, like, 21, but it's, I think it's 22 or some shit, or it's, it's like, 20, or, but it's basically, like, 21, and it's like, I fucking played hours just gambling on this game, you know, and it's just, yeah. like, you just spend so much time in it, and then once you're finally done with the store, which was like, if you're into video games, like I preached it before, play it, not to the public, because it's just one of the most rewarding games, and it still holds up to 2015 now, you know? I haven't played it in a long time. Fucking so good. Like I said, I just bought it at the App Store, because I saw it on the App Store, I was like, oh, I'll spend nine, nine bucks. bucks. Nine it, was like nine, it was like nine or five bucks, but I was like, worth it, because right. that's like, my said, you know what You know what you're yeah. getting, yeah. so, yeah, um... Mine would probably be like the ones that I can first remember. Like, I mean, not because most of the games we first started playing, they weren't like very story driven. Oh, yeah, they're, they're like Aladdin quick. And yeah, like, Earth One Gym and shit like that. Still yeah. get like that feeling of like accomplishment. Yeah. But I think like uh, Halo, it's probably like, whoa, well, like. Yeah, I, was, I haven't was, played that one in a while, but I did play Halo. The story wise. Was, I yeah, mean, that was. We could, I could have, I still did. I still, I still went to like the yeah. multiplayer bit of it. Yeah. And did all that. But yeah. once I did the run through. That, doesn't that have like, I think it's like one of the best story games of all time, isn't it? Like the whole Halo like series. Yeah, well, like, I mean, they split out books and like mini series. They were trying to do a movie and that yeah. movie looked pretty cool. Yeah, like the yeah. little leak footage that mm -hmm. like never got made, but Well, they, cool. they did do like a mini series using similar like looks yeah. and it came out pretty well. Which one? The it Four was called, Arms You Done? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember that was yeah. a YouTube when it came on YouTube yeah. first. A buddy I used to work with at a guitar center, uh, I'm not sure if he listens, but Zach, he was just like, hey, you ever seen this? And I'm like, you know, because we, he was also nerdy too, and we would watch on the way to work, and we were just like, fuck, he's like, you watched the you watch last night, like, dude, that's fucking badass, like, it's a cool fucking production. Yeah, like, it was really well done, I mean, they, they still, Especially at the end, where they, they finally see the Spartan, and you're just like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. you know, that shit was cool. I think they still will do a movie. Um, yeah, I, I think I was listening to should. the Kind of Funny Guys, and like... They were saying, like, it's there. Like, they, the material's there. Yeah. They just, someone needs to do it, but it's, like, big production, though. I mean, we kind of talked about before in the other podcasts, like, where I almost would be happy with just a series instead of a movie. Yeah. Because they yeah. go more depth, and you know you're going to get a story. More. Yeah, especially so, Netflix. It's surprising that Netflix yeah. won't pick it up, because they're just, like... I was surprised yesterday. Let's change the topic yeah. real quick. They, there was a show called Longmire that I liked. Yeah, that got canceled. Oh, really? And uh, I was flipping through Netflix real quick, and... The, it's, it says it's Netflix original now. Like they picked up the where it uh, left off, and they they they've been doing that, and I love that. Netflix like, is fucking cool. Dude. They know what they're yeah, doing, man. Yeah. They're smart. Yeah. So. Like it's 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 so like you know, speaking of Netflix, it's just so cool. Like. 
when they come out with their own series, like House of Cards, like I watch it and just like, boom, every episode, binge watch it. There hasn't been a Netflix original show that I haven't liked. Yeah, there's so many where I like. I'm also like you know I, I'm like I mean, I mean you know where I'm very skeptical. I'm like I don't know. Yeah. But once I jump in, I'm like all right, you know, like like my sister. Uh, I, um, I texted her because I got her in the snap judgment, and I was like, hey, have you heard the new snap judgment? Which is a fucking like the first story is fucking bad. It's about a badass female wolf, just like the very first episode. The first, no, the very first story of the latest episode. Oh, okay. It's just about this badass wolf. You know, it has a sad ending. But fucking badass, yeah. That's <laughs> a badass wolf. Like but, um, and she was like, oh, no, 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 And, um, and we started talking about Radio Lab. And do you remember that Radio Lab episode where they did, like, a whole theater musical? Yeah. And, like, I listened to my way to school because, like, at this point, in the episode, whatever episode Radio Lab, I'm listening to. Yeah. Like, because remember before, I wasn't doing it. I wasn't jumping in. I was like, I don't know. But, and I told her, I was like, anything Radio Lab does, I'm in. Yeah. Both feet. And she was like, I think I'm now getting there. I was like, I'm there, done, and fucking <laughs> towel dry now. You know, it just, but it's just, uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Netflix and shit, whatever. I, I got lost my thing. That's all good. Yeah. But yeah. So back to games. <laughs> What's your second game? Second game? Um, I mean, it doesn't you're, you're just Halo? Yeah, I go with it. Like the, with one, of the, one of the first ones that I can The first about. one? Wow. Um, my second one, um, I guess it's the trilogy. Oh, because I, I see. I know the, just the one was Mass Effect. Right. Because that game was like, holy fuck. The first one I liked. Second one I loved even more. And then, like, I think I got kind of tear in the second one. And then when the third one came, it fucking hit me. Like, you're seeing Jack Shepard, like, just go insane. Right. You know what I mean? It's like, the world's about to fucking die, or this and that. And it's just, like, so big. And then it ends. You're like, wait, what now? What? Yeah, what now? What? There's not more? What the fuck? Yeah, and just yeah. See, that's one of those games where I messed up. I played the first one like. The first one was kind of rough. Too. It was rough. Yeah. And that was one of my first games where, with the, that type of game. Yeah, that shooting RPG. And yeah, it was a weird, weird magic mixture. type. Of, yeah, yeah. And at that Power time, I wasn't game. really heavy into those type of games, yeah, so yeah. it kind of turned me off. Yeah. But that it, from the look, the looks, the the. The dialogue and the story, the concept of like choosing like dick, good or like, evil and everything. Good or evil, that your decisions matter to the whole franchise. That's like, fucking. I love that. Like dude. that. That was what drew me in. Yeah. And I just never picked up a controller for it again. Oh no. So I, I still really want. I know they're gonna do a remastered. Yeah, dude. I'm. I'll buy it. So I'm thinking like, about picking it up. Fry here's my money because right. I'm like, I know what I'm gonna expect, but to see it in all in 1080. And you can play it again differently. Exactly. Like that's the thing about Natural Republic. It's like yeah. the amount you get of different. Depending alternate endings and alternate decisions is so big yeah. and Mass Effect just had that one where it was just fucking like I mean it has some of the best not best but some of the funniest fucking decision making in the game like fucking spoiler alert but in the second one there's a part where um, you and you and your crew roll up to this one planet and you pop off because the second one I think you're dead and you get rich right type of thing you get crews and you can pop off yeah, <laughs> and so, so yeah, and so you and your crew go into this um, this planet, and then right if you right if you disembark off your ship and you're on the planet, there's like this news anchor chick, and she's like, Mister, she's like all in your face, like uh, Captain Shepard, Captain Shepard, Commander Shepard, blah, blah blah. Is it true? And depending what you did in the first game, she's like grilling your ass, and you're like, if you're good, you're like you know you're reflecting, you're fucking calm, but if you're yeah. if you're choosing evil or bad, you're kind of being a dick. And then, so she keeps grilling you, and like, either the second or third evil, you're like, boom! No. And you just drop her. And I, I was closed fist. Oh, not open. It's a straight boom. And I That's remember, I remember I was playing it, I was just like, whoa! <laughs> I was just like, are you kidding me? And then she's just like, she looks at the camera, did you get that? Did you get that? Yeah. And it's just, it's so funny. It was just like, are you kidding me? So like, you didn't knock her out cold. No, but you fucking hit her. And it's just the funniest thing because like, you don't expect it because the whole time you're like, do what I fucking had to do because you're being a dick. Right. The second one, it's just like, who matters what I fucking did? And you find your tiger just hit her. And I was just like, holy shit. Like, that was funny. Like, who, that. what other game has done that? Like, they have a bunch of other ones. I won't spoil it because you don't expect them yeah. when you do the evil choices. They're just like, oh shit, I just did that. Because the good ones are usually like, hey man, don't do that, you know? Like, uh, you're usually, like, if you're usually good, if you know RPGs, you're usually, like, talking out of the situation, persuasion, you know? Like, if you're evil, 
Your fucking punch it helps. I guess so. Jesus. <laughs> that was funny though. But yeah, so Mass Effect was probably like one of the biggest. Probably the biggest because that was like a trilogy and I spent so much time because that game is huge. Like, So I was going to ask you that like. Because my next one I was going to mention was the, uh, the Drake Uncharted series. Yeah, I like that. So, but the difference being, I know that there's another one coming. Yeah. And you know, and those ones, it's over. Like, that's it. Yeah. You know, so I'm guessing it's a uh, it's, it's different. It's going to ruin it because I don't, I, don't, I don't know there's a two or three on huh? it. Right, yeah. Uh. So, like, I, I was fortunate enough to, like, like well, see, it sucks I, that it's over now, but I know I have something to look forward to in the distant future. I think now, so. where I'm saying that is like um it's on my list but i won't do it yet but i'm so out of touch with spoilers when it comes to games that i don't know what i'm expecting out of because you know the uncharted series comes out actually back on my birthday and i don't know what to expect i don't know the storyline all i know is i think i'm some sort of treasure hunter that's about it. True. Yeah. And that's the guy's name is Drake. Like, I literally don't know anything. That's perfect. So, I think that I benefit from that yeah, because I don't know anything. I don't know what to expect. I know there's three games already. So, okay, obviously this guy survives. Yeah. But I don't know the story. And like I said, I'm a fucking sucker. Like, I'll fucking smoke up. My emotions are ready to go. And I'll probably cry. You know what I mean? So, it's just like... It's... I, I benefit in that way. I don't know spoilers. So like, so. for me, like... Drake has a great story and everything, but for me personally, it was like, it was such a fun, like, vast, like, just, it, it envelops, like, an epic adventure for me. Like, yeah. like, I just didn't want that fun and, like, what's next? I just wanted, what's next? Like, what, yeah. well, how are they going to top this yeah. next chapter? Like, and then the fourth one was dope. And the fourth one was amazing. Because like, I, I, like you, I haven't looked on, on I haven't, because I heard they released more. I didn't look at it because yeah. like oh, I see what this that came out. Um, was it was it called the com PlayStation Experience? No, 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 no. What the E three? E three. I, I saw they came out E three. I was like, fucking wow. You know, I was in class, but like I haven't seen anything else. So do you think they'll show more at PlayStation Experience? Um, because I've never like been to any type of convention like yeah. that. So like this is my first time. Danielle's first time. Like so update. We're all going to the PlayStation Experience December. Yeah. Fifth and six. Fifth and six. So yeah. if you guys want to join us. But not only if you can't join us, we are doing a car cast. We are we're gonna doing, try it. I think we're gonna we're do gonna it. Try. We're doing a car cast. And how uh, it's gonna be tricky, but I tr oh, with your laptop and everything, like we're gonna upload it before we go. So, yeah. you know, it won't be the best editing and everything, but like we wanna do this whole journey and I think it'd be fun for people to join us on this journey. So we're doing a car cast. We're doing uh, probably like a pre-game podcast before we go into Something it. Small. Something small. Just yeah. kind of like, hey, and then we're going to try to do, if not in there, we're going to try to get some recordings inside, some maybe, maybe interviews, some video, something, like, definitely video, yeah, and then we'll do a post-game fucking cast and chop it up, chop it up. and then after, after the two-day experience, um, we're going to do a full-on wrap-up of another car cast on the way home and just kind of like... Yeah. Chop it up a little bit of what we saw and a little bit what we were doing, you know, everything. So, oh, like, are you like, are you signaling me? Like, hey. sorry. So, just like a short girl. Like a short girl. <laughs> sorry, guys. Um, so, yeah, if you guys have like questions for us, to, like, do you want us to, to go look at or, you know, I don't know how many are gamers uh, out there listening, but. Or even know, like, what is it? Yeah, so what's it about? If you have questions about it, let, let us know. On um, Twitter. And, uh, hit us up on the Twits. Yeah, everything, even the email. But uh, yeah, so what's your love of the game? Yeah, one um, more. So I got one more too. I forgot what it was. Dang it. Must have been not that important. Uh, Go ahead. All right, so like this, I didn't want to spoil it, but the game that hit me yeah. was Last of Us. Because I knew nothing about that Obviously, game. Yeah. I knew nothing about that game. Right. And but not only did I ball... You know what I mean? Like fuck the beginning end, and I mean beginning, middle, and end. Yeah. I fucking like teared it's up. It's literally a roller coaster of emotions. It's so well then. I remember like I was playing the game because I had nothing to play for really. a little while, and that beginning, I fucking got teary and everything. I tweeted out, I was like, "Fuck, Last of Us still gets me every time." Yeah. And then like I think I hashtag Last of Us, and I think I did a um, an at tag for um, not Naughty Dog, 
and I had like two replies from just people who randomly been there and started following me. They're like, do you have kids? Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, <laughs> well, if you count my cat as a kid, yeah. yes, I do. Like, I have emotions. I directly correlated with my kid. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But, um, Sorry, guy. No, but so Last of Us, the great fucking story and everything, but at the very end, because how it ended too, you're just like that, you know, what's her name? Ellie. Ellie. At the end, she's just like, okay. And you're just like, what, what's it? I want to go to the village. I want to take her there, you know? It's just like, it ended and it was just like, not only was it like, that's it, but it was just like, fuck, like, because yeah, the I game know. is just nonstop, like, roller coaster, roller coaster. It's, I wouldn't say even valleys. It's just constant, it's like, like up. up or it's down or. It's just, it's never like a valley. It's just like, pretty much just, it never really gets better. Yeah, no, it, yeah. it never gets fucking like calm. It's just constant fucking emotions. And it's, it's realistic though. And, yeah, oh yeah, for the scenario. And then I remember at the very end, you're just kind of like, wait, that's it? Right. Like, now I can breathe? Like you feel kind of empty. Like Very empty. Yeah. That was probably the greatest emptiness. Oh, I highly forgot that. That was yeah. on my list. I figured that would, we would share that one. I didn't write it on my actual pad. I had uh, it on this pad, but on this pad. Yeah, pad. Why the hate you throwing things weird? But uh, another one, I just, not as much, but um, I did feel it was the first Dragon Age. That was, not, that was a really fun game where you could spend hours upon and everything. And once it ended, it had one of those great like Mass Effects where every little decision, little decision that you made at the final ending, you would see like how it affected your world. And it was just like, <gasps> but it was just like, wait, no. Like, you know what I mean? Like, no, I didn't want him to do that, you know? Yeah. So that yeah. was another one. We wish it took a different chance. Exactly. But probably the greatest then <clears throat> emptiness was Last of Us, which yeah. it sucks that they're making the second one because it's like... No, like you had me. You leave the, it alone. Leave it alone. You know, like I don't know. I'm torn between that decision. But then I, I understand why they're doing this second one because it's like it could be very interesting. But like you know, like it's how we feel about the originals. We're like we're so attached to it. And they're like, no, don't do that. You yeah. know, like you had me. It's understandable. Yeah, but yeah. So, well, I think that about does it. Yeah. So, um, we'll probably I don't know on this podcast we're gonna do video try to release both been simultaneously or it doesn't matter probably I don't know what. We'll do, we'll do Whatever. what we can. Do what you can. We'll do what we can, folks. Again, follow us. Uh, let us know what you think of the video. At Big Fan Pod on Twitter. Big Fan Pod at dot Gmail. Com. Dot, uh, the, the dot com. com. So, yeah. So, how we're going to do it is the video will be just on the website. Yeah. And um, that, that's the beeper. Sorry about that. And so, uh, yeah. Until... <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> so, as you have two fucking pads. I'm new. <laughs> I just realized there's two pads up here. But yeah, so uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoy. Thank you.